Hi kings and queens, what is good? It has been a while and no see, but I'm back now and I have been away sorting out some very personal things for myself and also to organize places that you will be staying when you are in Ghana this December. Remember that to December in Ghana? Yes, it's a tradition in Ghana, especially in Accra, Ghana and Takrade, December is always lit. So I felt like, okay, what can I do for my subscribers who will be, or my viewers who will be visiting Ghana and will be looking for where to stay and be comfortable? Then I thought about showing you guys some amazing places around that you can stay for affordable price. If you're coming with your family, you're coming with young children, especially hotel is not, is never the best place at all. Hotels are not bad, but this place is going to be more conducive for your, you know, for a family. You're coming with the entire family to enjoy Africa, to enjoy Ghana. Oh my goodness. I got you covered. Okay. This place is up for grab. So why I'm filming the whole of outside like this is because i want you to see what it looks like because what you see is what you get and even um better surprises when you finally hear so please make sure to like this video don't forget to share it because i know somebody needs it somebody needs to see it somebody is coming to ghana this for 30 december you know how we do it we party all day and night in ghana from morning to morning and this year i shall be on the streets of accra ghana checking out who is in town trust me and it's gonna be lit by the grace of god okay so you all i wanted to see the outside i'm um this um natural person i love nature a lot especially where i live i want it as natural as possible and this place i've got that Another fun part about this building is that this uh, apartment is not far from the Iburi uh, mountain. Iburi is one of those most visited sites in Ghana. Uh, if you are around the Accra environment, you're around, in fact, as a non Ghanaian or even a Ghanaian who have been away for long, the first place you want to visit is the Iburi mountain the weather the a lot of things there a lot of people especially the Iburi botanical garden will make you want to visit and this place is not far from there so it's about 10 minutes drive from here to um, Iburi mountain if i'm not mistaken it's even less than five minutes drive from here you can get to see the view of the mountain and stuff so this is what the the is this veranda or corridor <laughs> okay so this is what it looks like um as you go in you can sit outside here just to take a uh, fresh breeze and another fun thing is the environment about this place is that the environment is very quiet it's a very quiet place so if you're someone like me that is a thinker i like to think i like to spend quality time alone and i like calm environment this place is highly highly recommended and of course if you are here with your family you're coming for a wedding you're coming with a lot of people for a whole, for a meeting for events this place shouldn't slip out of your hands okay all you need to do is go to the description of this video on how to book i'm going to show you how to book before you be in ghana before you even um by tomorrow everything that you need all your towel your pillows that you didn't see in this video will be available okay as we speak everything is ready but this at, at the time i went there i took the video since last week you know so um arrangements were on ground to get all of that so in case you're not seeing it in the video is due to the fact that at, at the time i went it wasn't there but right now everything is ready ready for you to come and have fun okay so this is what the bathroom looks like all right they have the master the one of the rooms you know some rooms have masters while some you share a bathroom with someone so i'm going to take you through that and what about the lighting inside very very on point so room number one just showing you what it looks like and the 
just what to expect if you're coming here the, another fun thing about here is the fact that it is um it is how do i put it okay hold on the fun part for us is the kitchen okay so is a kitchen seriously i thought this house is beautiful but hold on until you see the kitchen uh the kitchen is just gonna blow you away even if you hate if you're not the type that cooks when you see this kitchen it will motivate you to cook so hold on so this is what the dining area looks like before you will finish booking like i said everything is settled and ready for you so now let's go to the most to our favorite part of the house which is the kitchen Ooh la la Ooh la la my camera is not doing justice i have wished to take it you know i show you what it looks like once so you, you get to see this is how the kitchen the microwave the oven they have everything that you need to make your stay comfortable in this place without having to buy food except you just want to buy or order for food if you want to cook you want to microwave anything this place got you covered okay and there'll be someone on ground to take care of you take care of your needs maybe you want to buy something you don't want to go outside you don't want to order that person goes for you tidy up the whole place for you so this is what the kitchen looks like it's some part of the kitchen it's difficult to get it all but definitely my favorite part of the house kitchens have always been my favorite part but this kitchen in particular is just too amazing to be true so yeah you are welcome to ghana and don't forget to check the description of this video on how to book your space book ahead okay don't wait till that time that you start to look for where to stay especially if you're coming to ghana in groups oh my goodness you're gonna thank me because this place is super affordable if you're coming in groups Put your monies together and come and enjoy your stay in this place, okay? By the time you are here, like I told you, all the furnitures you need, if you need them fat before then, everything is duly, fully ready and waiting for you to come make it your home. All right. So this house, we are not renting it for a whole year. The highest we can give out is six months okay it's short let so it's a private place and um just private place so we need people that will stay for some time especially those that come in for holidays if you're planning a trip to ghana right now the first thing you should do is book for this place now because i know a lot of people are gonna book for it book for it before others will see and book ahead and leave you with no space okay all right so i'm going to continue to show you guys around for me i'm obsessed with the kitchen i will not lie i love kitchens okay when i'm renting or building my house god knows that a kitchen i'm definitely gonna make my kitchen look this beautiful so uncomfortable clean simple at the same time i really don't know what to classify this kitchen as but i'll just use the word classic for it. it's simple and just amazing so let's take you guys around and take you to the other room because i didn't show you guys the other room so we're gonna go there washing machines here all you need to do is just take your clothes put them inside the washing machine or you ask the guy on grand who the cleaner the attendant to take care of that for you and they will get it done for you there's water electricity 24 hours of course you are in ghana don't forget don't play don't play in ghana don't play no power outage okay this one i'm beating my chest to see it okay so yeah like i told you i'm obsessed with the kitchen okay so pardon me if i keep showing you that part of the house way too long I'm sorry this is Lily I love kitchens because I love to cook and when the kitchen is this pretty it takes my bread away so yeah um, I have to give up and go to the other room because Bella was calling me to come and see so this is one of the rooms yeah we didn't want to open it because I believe you've seen one of the rooms the other time 
so it's like that and then this is one of the bathrooms all right this one looks like this this house is new and have not been occupied before by a lot of people you know just uh, a new place and um, located here in Accra Ghana so like I told you guys it's just about 10 minutes drive from here to Iburi mountain and from the airport to this place without traffic is about 30 minutes with traffic which is not common especially for you as um someone that is coming for holidays you wouldn't be going out uh, early morning to you know where are you going bro sis you have to be in bed enjoy your life okay so you don't have anything to worry about traffic you're not gonna go out during the rush hour which is usually the people who are doing a uh, five to seven i mean six to five or oh, okay nine, five to six five to nine yeah job people that are going to work in the morning so during the hour of the day you may experience a little bit of traffic aside that is a free way all right from the airport to this place is definitely less than 30 minutes let me know like it's definitely less than 30 minutes from madina from this place to madina is about 10 minutes Okay, let's say 12 minutes or 15 minutes, as the case may be. And then from Madina to the airport, which is about, is it up to, it's not, it's about 20. Is it up to 20 minutes? Yeah, everything is like 30 minutes. Let's leave it like that, rough estimate of, you know, the time. So let's go outside and see what it looks like out there. This is my own little token for you watching my videos, for those searching where to stay for those looking for information about ghana on my channel so book for this place ahead quickly you can contact me if you want but everything you need to know about here will be down there in the description of this video all right and uh the area is uber accessible you know ubers come here i mean is it come or comes yeah one of those words sorry so uber comes here and um, any time of the day by the way, you are in Ghana, I mean, it's very peaceful. The security in Ghana is, please, one of the best, second best in Africa. You know what that means. So, I mean, you don't have any problem. So, thank you for watching. Don't forget to check the description. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.